Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Lisa, Best Life Lee. Well, I have completed my painting project of my bureau. I finished that and I finished painting the mirror and two end tables, which will be our nightstands. So I was able to find some draw poles that match. And so I'm gonna show you the whole process from you know getting started in the morning what i had to do to prepare the tables to get those painted and how everything came out i did have to do some wood putty to close up the holes that were on those drawers that i was having such a hard time finding a draw pole that would fit i ultimately could not find one that would fit in the existing holes so i did have to cover them up fill them in and drill new holes, but I have done it. I do love how this whole thing came out. So if you wanna see how I accomplished this task, then just keep on watching. guys I am ready to paint the bureau and I'm gonna paint the mirror and I have all the drawers filled with the wood filler that I'm gonna sand these are for the nightstand they're looking pretty rough right about now but that's okay because they're gonna get sanded and painted and I have my two end tables that I'm gonna be painting to match that are gonna be our nightstands. These are tables that I have had for many years. And that little table is gonna get spray painted white and it's gonna go on the balcony with the white wicker exactly. chairs. I am going to get started and you really should get a very early start with these projects because the prep takes longer than the actual painting. I have cleaned all the dust out and everything from inside here. So yeah, let's get started. All right, so before I get started painting uh, my end tables, I have to tighten them up. The legs are a little bit loose and they have like a wing nut. Um, they have some screws too, but these wing nut type um, screws were like so old that I couldn't turn them with my hands so I had to get like a one of those kind of I don't even know what you call it but you can see how it's like a wrench and you could see how loose that leg is this wing nut I could turn a little bit but basically I had to use the force of that wrench to get them nice and tight but I did tighten up all the legs so the tables really are in amazing shape. Whose bright idea was it to paint all this furniture and move? <laughs> oh yeah, it was mine. Oops, there goes another nail. <laughs> yeah, hard to keep nails on when you're doing this kind of stuff. But that's all right, I'll fix them later. I will fix them later. All right, let's see if we can get this underside painted first. Oh, I will be so glad the moving day gets here. I 
know I probably don't have to paint under here, but I'm going to just give it a real finished look. Feeling you'd come back and save me From all those lonely nights and heartbreaks And I feel misplaced without you Why don't we go back to Why don't we go back to Never wanted to end it like we did I guess shit happens for a reason But it's like something feels different from back then Why don't we go Getting there, so I got some of the draws back in. Um, these draws are all set. Um, they're not perfect. You can see a little bit of where my wood filler is, but I think that when they're on the bureau, you're really not going to be able to tell. I got the draws for the nightstands done, and I think what I'm going to do. There's the nightstands. I think they came out beautiful. My mirror looks good. Um, so two coats, that's all it took to get this color, um, on that dark wood. So I'm thrilled. I'm going to stick with these knobs and these draw poles. I'm going to go back to Lowe's since I did cover this, these holes, I'm just going to go and, um, get those covers. I mean, I'm just going to go and get those poles and, uh, that way everything matches rather than do something that doesn't match. And I will do the same poles. On the nightstands so it'll all look like it all belongs together and it was all that way so i'm gonna go to lowe's tomorrow probably and get that it is now uh, five o'clock i started this project at about 9 30 this morning um i did start the spray paint job as well but um that i ran out of spray paint and i just couldn't keep going on that end i had to give up so, um, yeah, when I get everything finished tomorrow, I will show you the finished product. But for now, I am tired.
new set I have my two nightstands I think the color is just so rich looking so pretty and the mirror is perfect so yeah this is my new bedroom set we're gonna have a, a brand new bed and a brand new headboard um, which I can't wait to show you the whole thing when it's in the new place. So, yeah, it was well worth it, well worth the work it took to get it here, but I am absolutely thrilled. All right, guys, well, that's going to do it for this video. I have to tell you, I am so thrilled with how this came out. I absolutely love the Magnolia Home paint that I used in the magnolia green. I absolutely love this color and I love the paint uh, for furniture. It is absolutely gorgeous. It has a nice satin finish. Uh, really, really beautiful. So I am getting to the home stretch here for this whole moving process. It Next week will be the beginning of May and I will only have three weeks before move-in date on May 24th. So now that my painting project is out of the way, I'm gonna really just buckle down and get the rest of my stuff um, packed and ready for the movers. And I am going to just be working on cleaning everything so that I leave this house in excellent shape for Julie and Alec when they move in with Baxter. So uh, yeah, come along with me in my journey. I do have one video before the rest of the three week period as I prepare for the ultimate move in that is going to be a capsule wardrobe video. I'm trying to whittle down my wardrobe to get me through the next four weeks. So I'm gonna show you the outfits that I have put together or I'm in the process of putting together for my capsule wardrobe and hopefully it can give you some ideas of some outfits to put together yourself. So I hope so, that you will tune in on Thursday because that's when I plan it on putting up the capsule wardrobe video. So thanks again everyone for tuning in, showing up, commenting on the videos, being with me in this process of moving out of a home that I have lived in for over 20 years. It is quite a journey for me, but I'm very excited and I am very happy to have you all along with me on this journey. If you're new here, I hope that you'll consider subscribing and getting to know what my channel is all about. So take care everyone. I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.